My name is Christian Bro, and today I'll be going over TSIS Corsum 2022. TSIS Corsum is a microscopic simulation software developed for planning and operational analysis. In this video, I'll be going over the basics of the software and some of the new features for this release, such as Bing Maps. Well, let's take a look at the software now. It's very easy to get straight into modeling a network. Simply click the New or Open buttons at the top or under the File menu. You can also choose a recent file from the file menu. When you create or open a network file, MapView will immediately display. MapView is the graphical interface for editing your network and viewing animation. Let's take a look at the tools at the top of MapView. In this first group, you will find shortcut information, map settings, and a Bing Maps location editor, which we'll go over later. The next group contains your links and nodes, which will also be covered later. Here you'll find your basic camera and mouse tools, such as the pointer tool, panning, and zooming in and out. Afterwards, we have your toggle features, such as enabling or disabling link names, free flow speeds, links, or the grid lines. Finally, we have your animation tools, which will also be covered later. Now let's take a look at the Bing Maps editor. The editor is fairly simple. Just click and drag to move the map around, and zoom in and out to change your scale. If you prefer a satellite image, you can choose that over the traditional map by changing the map photo type. Tisa's Corsum also has a smart location finder. You don't need the full address, simply type in a keyword and you'll be moved to where you need to be. By default, TSIS Corsum also scales your Bing Maps image for you. The distance between each axis line in TSIS is 100 feet, so if your map scale bar shows 500 feet, then the scale bar will fit exactly between six axis lines. Next, let's talk about the node and link structure. There are three types of nodes and three types of links to choose from. The leftmost is the entry exit node. Think of these as your origin and destination nodes. You'll specify entry volumes at entry nodes, and Corsum will automatically calculate vehicles exiting the network to exit nodes using turn multipliers. Next is the interface node. These nodes are used to specify a ramp between a street level network and a freeway level network. Finally, there's your standard nodes. These are used to connect lanes between links. While they have much more uses than for intersections, you'll find a lot of turning, movement, and control-related properties in them. For links, there are two main types, street and freeway. You can specify one-way and two-way street links, as well as one-way freeway links. By connecting two standard nodes with a street or freeway link, TSIS will automatically convert your standard node to a freeway or street node, allowing you to edit them in detail. Let's take a look at the simulation next. Simulating your network is easy. Simply click the Corsum button at the top, and you can instantly run your network through Corsum. If you want to specify properties for output processing, file format, or multiple runs, you can find that under Options, Run Properties. When Corsum finishes running, the output results will be displayed. Here, you can find descriptive statistics for each link and node, as well as the whole network. Once Corsum has run and has generated an animation file, you can choose between two simulation viewers, TrafView or the MapView animation. In both softwares, you'll notice vehicles are color-coded. This color coding is based on desired turn movements. White vehicles are going straight, left vehicles want to turn left, yellow vehicles want to turn right, and blue vehicles want to make diagonal movements. If you also have HCS installed, you can view animation and simulation results from your network in TSIS Corsum 2022 simply by clicking the top menu button, Corsum, View Animation. This will open up TSIS and then automatically convert your network file, run Corsum, 
and then prepare the animation for you. 